Hey guys, what's up? So I'm gonna show you guys a really cool mod today, and this mod is called Mine Video for Minecraft 1.2.5. So I have made an old video of the past for Minecraft 1.2.4 for this mod, but the creator of the mod has sent me a message mentioning the improvements of this mod, and immediately I wanted to make a video. This mod has really changed. But what is Mine Video? When recording videos of your Minecraft experience, you often face problems like bad video quality, huge files that you have to compress afterwards, bad in-game performance, expensive, limited, or complicated tools or softwares, or sometimes you have to deal with the company's names on your video. Well, now there's a solution, a free video and audio capture mod. Yes, you heard me correct, a mod. Can you believe that? A Minecraft mod that is free to download that allows you to capture your gameplay for free. And in my personal opinion, this mod rocks! So let's talk about the features of this mod. When you press F6, it'll bring up the Mine Video video option. Here you can change the video format, so you can just click on that and you'll change it to different formats of video, so I just like to keep at default .avi. You could also change the frame rates of your video, so I'm going to keep it at a default 30, you could change it up to 60, which is the max, and you could go to the lowest but 30 is a decent frame rate. Now the output directory, this is where your videos are gonna be saved at. In the tutorial part of my video, I'm gonna show you how to create yourself a videos folder located in your .minecraft folder, but this is where all your videos are gonna be stored at. And the file name template, you really don't have to be messing with this, I'm just gonna leave it default. I believe there's no need to edit that section. But we're not done yet, the new improvement of mine video allows you to capture your audio recording, so you could be talking while you're playing and and you could be recording everything that you do. So you can change your audio format to any other audio format that you like, but I like to keep it at .wav because a lot of editing softwares are compatible and could use .wav audio formats. Now the stereo, you could leave it on or off because it doesn't really make a difference when I record with it. Now here's the part where the quality of your audio recording comes in hand, so you have to be messing with the sample rate. If you go all the way to the lowest, which is 8000, you're not going to record your audio very clearly. It's going to be kind of bad but I would recommend to put it to the highest amount which is 44,100 if you put it to that high amount you're gonna be able to record really good audio and once you are done just go ahead and press done because the rest is basically describing where the files are gonna be saved at but you guys already know where the files gonna be saved at so when you are ready to record all you do is press F4 you're gonna hear this sound once you have heard that chicken egg, then there we go, I am now recording, and guess what, I am recording with Fraps and Mine Video, and I am not lagging at all, look, I'm punching a tree, and there seems to be no lag, I'm gonna show you both the videos playing at the exact same time, and you're gonna be able to see the difference between both the videos, they're gonna be exactly the same, Fraps and Mine Video. So press F4 once again to stop the recording, and now you're gonna receive a message, saying that the video has been saved, and it'll display the date, and that's the file name. So now let's check out both the videos. Now let me record video and audio with Mind Video. Hey guys, what's up? So now I am recording my video using Mind Video. So if you're hearing my audio, that means that Mind Video is recording my audio. I'm not 100% sure how it sounds at the moment, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be really awesome because I know the update of Mind Video really did an amazing job allowing us to record our, you know, audio using this mod. So if you guys are listening to me right now, this is the quality of the top quality using Mind Video of recording audio. So yes, it probably is really awesome. This is the video, so I am like, you know, punching myself some dirt right now and it should be able to capture everything really good just like fraps and maybe even better depending on you know what type of computer you have so I would recommend to try out mine video for yourself another thing I wanted to show was my FPS so just in case something would happen and you guys want to see my FPS check it out it's not really that bad so when I started uh, you know recording now it's going up to the red but it's not really that bad of lag I still am able to capture you know 43 FPS of gameplay so that's pretty decent that's just like when I use fraps it does the exact same thing this mod also captures your multiplayer experience 
so you could join any server that you like and start recording. Or maybe you want to show off a building that you just ended up creating. Here is a building that I found at Play Balls of Steel server so you could check out that server and check out this building and fly around it because they have a creative world. And today marks off their first year anniversary of their server. It's been up for one year already. Congrats Sigvis and Mudbill. So mine video improved quite a bit from the last time I reviewed it with the new GUIs that work 100% of the time. We are now able to record with higher FPS. And big props to both Kovu, the creator of this mod, and Maya Knife, who has worked extremely hard on this mod. Alright guys, so that's basically it. If you guys are still interested in this mod, you guys want to install this mod, this mod is really easy to install. So if you guys want this world download, go ahead and get it from my description, links in description. Let's go ahead and see how to install this mod. It's actually really easy. Thank you guys so much for rating my videos, I really do appreciate it. Alright, so let's go ahead and install this mod. This mod is really easy to install, so we shouldn't have any errors. But the first thing I'm going to want to do, of course, before installing this mod is to go here to Options and Force Ultimate Game. The reason why I'm going to force Ultimate Game is because I have mods currently installed. If you guys have mods currently installed, I always recommend to back them up because you're never too sure if this mod is compatible with any of your mods. If it's not compatible, you will get black screen and you won't be happy. So Options, Force Update, and Login to download a brand new Minecraft thought jar in which we're going to mod. I'm going to go ahead and leave this updating, so I'm going to minus this and you're gonna get the downloads from the forum thread the reason why I'm gonna have you go to the forum thread is because you have to double check that your uh, you know software operating system can actually handle mine video so go ahead and double check it should be able to handle it all you're gonna get is mod loader and the mine video download so this is located at the thread of his uh, you know forum so you can check that out maybe you know uh, give him a good compliment saying that hey you know what this is a really good mod so once you have the downloads drag it here to the desktop in which you can see it better but maybe some of you guys are wondering where is the download for mine video so here is mine video the thread and here's a really cool camera so you just scroll all the way down to you find the section called download so here's downloads mine video version 1.2 that's the one I was using so go here to curse so click there and then it's gonna take you here to mine video and then you're gonna see right up here download now so click download now and it should be able to uh, download you know the mod in three seconds so let that count down and it should be downloading so yeah and then you're gonna get mod loader you should know how to get mod loader you just uh, type it in Google put mod loader it's gonna take you to Risugami's thread and you just locate mod loader and just download it it's very simple to get mod loader so once you have the downloads let's go ahead and install this mod we're gonna go here to start search your program file we're gonna type in percent app data percent and for Windows XP users you should see here run and you run percent data percent and it should take you up here to the roaming folder. Click on the roaming folder and you should see dot minecraft at the very top. When you go into your dot minecraft folder, you're gonna see bin, resources, save, and everything else. Go ahead and go into your bin folder. Before you open up your Minecraft thought jar that's located in your bin folder, you have to make sure you have your Minecraft game closed. Here's my Minecraft game that I just forced updated. You have to exit off your Minecraft game before installing any mod. So exit off your Minecraft game. Now you're going to right click your Minecraft thought jar that's located in your bin folder, open with WinRAR or any 7 zip opener. If you don't have WinRAR, links in the description. So go ahead and open that up with WinRAR and move it aside. The first thing you have to do, of course, before installing any mods is to delete MetaInf. You have to delete MetaInf. So right click MetaInf and delete files. Say yes and delete MetaInf. Now MetaInf is gone. Now we can continue. You're going to open a mod loader. So go ahead and open a mod loader. You're going to open that up and move it aside. You're going to highlight the files from mod loader and simply drag them all into your Minecraft.jar site and replace press OK. And you are done with mod loader. Go ahead and exit off mod loader and move it aside. Now you need mine video. So go ahead and open a mine video. You're going to move that aside. You're going to go into the folder that says mine video. You're going to see a little bit of files, but that all these files contain a lot of files. If I don't know how to explain this, but these folders have a lot of files. But you're just going to highlight all the files. Just highlight all the files from mine video and simply drag them all into the, uh, you know, Minecraft.dry side. Wait a little bit. It's going to be a long drag over because it's extracting. Add and replace, press OK, and just let this run through. It's going to be a long, you know, uh, updating of the Minecraft.jar. So just let that happen. All you have to do is just highlight these files from mine video and drag it into your Minecraft.jar side. But we are not done yet. So just once you are done with that, go ahead and exit off your Minecraft.jar and exit off your mine video. So go ahead and exit off 
have both those zips make sure you're still in your bin folder where you open up your minecraft thought jar with winrar because you're going to go back once to so go back to your dot minecraft folder with bin resources saved and everything else if you don't have a videos folder you have to create a videos folder okay because you will get a black screen if you press f4 so i have a videos folder i already made it earlier before and i cannot delete it because i was trying to delete it earlier just to make this video but i can't delete it because i already have videos in here that i'm using for this uh you know for this video so here's my editing that i am currently working on and look look how much editing this is but anyways what was i was saying uh as i was saying yeah as i was saying uh i already have a videos folder so all you have to do is create a video folder in your dot minecraft folder so called videos v i d e o s videos so put it into your dot minecraft folder and once you have done that you should be able to record your gameplay and have fun with it and that's basically it guys that's how to install the mod all you have to do is just highlight some files drag it into your minecraft.jar and run the game and it will freeze for a bit but then it'll start working so then go to single player go into any world you like then you could just you know press your uh, f4 key or you could just press f6 to see uh you know the frame rates and just adjust this to your liking uh i recommend dot avi like i said and once you have all this you could go ahead and press f4 and you should be able to start re uh, recording your gameplay so now i'm going to press f4 so now i pressed f4 and it should be recording my gameplay and then if i press f4 again it's going to stop my gameplay now let's go locate it in our dot minecraft folder in our videos folder so let's go to our videos folder and it should be right here this is the file that i just recorded right now and if you see in comparison the little thumbnail uh, you'll see that i have myself the uh, fishing pole so there we go there we go the mod did work and it is really awesome so all right so that's basically it hopefully you guys will enjoy this mod this mod is really cool i'm gonna go ahead and catch you guys later thank you guys for all your support see you around